Hey, Dwight Clow here, Inner Wealth. Hey, I just want to share a little story with you, uh, something about myself. Um, years ago, when my wife uh, used to get sick, uh, I would get angry. And I know you're probably thinking, Dwight, that's really weird. Well, I did. You know, she would be sick, and I would be angry, and actually, I really acted like a jerk, you know? I get really snippy with her, like, uh, you know, how long are you going to be sick? Why are you making me do all your work? And yada yada. And um, I think that, uh, you know, any uh, uh, good Christian uh, looking at me would probably say, Dwight, you're being a jerk. You know, you need to stop treating your wife like this. And I would agree, I was being a jerk. Um, but, and, and actually I wanted to change, but uh, I just, is as hard as I tried to be patient and kind and gentle, just this, this undercurrent of anger just kept coming through. And uh, then, you know, as I was processing all of this with the Lord, uh, something just came to me. You know, when I was growing up, I, I didn't, rightly or wrongly, I didn't feel safe around my dad. And so when my mom was sick, I just... Uh, uh, it felt like there was nobody to protect me from my dad. And so I felt very vulnerable and frightened when my mom was sick. And I kind of carried that message into, <clears throat> excuse me, into my adult life. And uh, so I kind of learned that when, my, uh, uh, when the woman in my life is sick, that I am not safe. And so... Anyway, I processed all of that with the Lord, and He just shared some truth with me that kind of changed that narrative in my mind. So I no longer was carrying this thought that when the woman in your life is sick, uh, you know, that you're not safe. And so I actually made this change uh, right, uh, you know, as the Lord shared that truth with me. And then... Uh, when uh, the next time my wife got sick, it was like amazing, you know? I just wasn't bothered anymore. It wasn't having uh, the same effect on me that it was having before. I didn't feel all this anger. And so as a result, uh, you know, I was able to help her and then she got better and everything was fine. So anyway, I share that with you because uh, tomorrow, uh, those of you who are Inner Wealth subscribers, we're just going to talk about this whole process of how do we change? You know, the Bible has a word for it, calls it repentance. That's a, a process and a word that's not very well understood. But once we get how that process works, it's like amazing. You know, uh, God is just able to do this beautiful work inside us. And the, this, the behaviors that uh, used to dominate our lives just no longer make sense. So hope I'll be able to share that with you and uh, hope that this story was encouraging. Have a super day.